so many languages. Bloody ink. Ooh, look at all these options on the menu. More games. Uh-oh, that just opened a internet browser window to the doesn't matter games website. Let's see. Let's uh, uh, uh well I'm here. <laughs> games. Bloody Ink, the telephone lost alone and who knocks. Okay. So now that I'm playing Bloody Ink, I will have played all of the Doesn't Matter games, and my life will be complete. Ooh, fire a reload? Oh, I hope there's actually a gun in this one and not the stupid burning your enemies with the cross. Because <laughs> that was not my favorite part of the telephone. In fact, that was my least favorite part of it. Uh, bu 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 um. Uh, I don't uh, I don't know uh, the options. What is the hour of fear? I feel like that's like a like an, uh, an after you're done the game kind of thing, but let's click on it anyway. Just find out. Uh, welcome to the demo of Bloody Ink, the hour of fear. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. I should play this first then. Durr. You'll take on the role of Frederick, a young nurse who must care for the burned man. This demo has a separate story that won't spoil the experience of the full game. Have fun. Okay, wicked. That's great. That's exactly what I want right now, actually. Okay, uh, dropped in with no fanfare, no cutscene or anything. All right, just to give a little bit of a background. Hold on, I want to get to my uh, OBS here so I can see myself. <laughs> so I can see myself narrate or speak, I don't know, whatever. Um, okay, so Bloody Ink is the newest game from Doesn't Matter Games. Um, doesn't matter games is the developer of uh the games i just listed which are who knocks lost alone slash lost alone ultimate and the telephone i have played all three of these games i thought they were all pretty good uh lost alone my favorite of the the trio so uh by far um, and then who knocks is also pretty good and the telephone i don't know left me uh, honestly, it left me a little bit cold. I think I enjoyed it, or I think I said I enjoyed it after I finished playing it. Um, you know, but after some time to sit and really reflect on it, it was like, eh, it didn't do as much for me as Lost Alone did. And I played Who Knocks after both of those, even though that's out of order. But it doesn't matter. The order doesn't matter. Um, and Who Knocks, I, I quite enjoyed, actually. It was, it was very, um similar to Lost Alone, and so is the telephone in a lot of ways, but uh, they all have their own little thing, and I don't know what Bloody Inks is. I have not, I didn't even know this game existed until earlier this week. Uh, that is the week I'm recording it, which is late April, uh, and Bloody Ink was actually released uh, near the end of May 2024, so just over a month ago, and um, nobody told me. Steam! Come on, why would you not send me an email suggesting, hey, uh, we know you really like these games, you play them a lot. Maybe you should try this one from the same developer. But uh, yeah, that just didn't happen. They only send me emails when there's a sale. And I think that's the only time Steam sends me emails. <laughs> so. <laughs> okay, um, actually, I have to take a quick break to do something, and I will be right back. You won't even know I'm gone. I don't know why I even bothered to say it. All right, all right. Now, I have returned, and it's time for Bloody Ink, the Hour of Fear. It doesn't open. It seems electronically locked. Yeah, look at this. It's got, like, the exact same graphics as uh, the telephone. Which is what I was expecting. Picked up candle. Look, the, the, the tool tips are uh, in the middle now. Uh, so that's um, streamers and let's players' face cams don't get in the way. 
You know, I joke about that, but that might actually be why. Uh, even, wow, look at that. To take care of the burned man, you have a list with a set of tasks to perform. To check it, press the button. Ooh, look, the new inventory screen. Dude. Oh. Hey, that's the same hand as from, uh, who knocks? Okay. Task list. It's got the same scar, like, right on the base of the thumb. Daniel. Danielle. Sorry, I really, I'm, I'm not sure how I'm supposed to pronounce your name. Um, are you just reusing hands? Are you just reusing, reusing hand textures? Why? Why would you do that? I know why you did that. Okay, I'm, I'm joking. I jest. I jest. Uh, check that the patient is well. Change the patient's IV. Organize the postcards. Oops. That's inventory. I am curious what I have, though. I have Lonely Strike Cigarettes. Task list. And a candle. Uh, duration is about three minutes. Oh, nice. They didn't tell you how long the candles last in the other games, I don't think. I don't remember. Doesn't open. Electronically locked does open. So we got second corridor or living room. I'm going to go living room first. If you have never experienced a doesn't matter game before, um, it's basically this. It is cabinet opening simulator and uh, picking up random baubles. And uh, lots of AI art. The theme of this one seems to be uh, ladies with barbed wire um, unfortunately placed on their selves. I mean, it's bad to have barbed wire anywhere on your body. So I wasn't, like, trying to insinuate that it was on any specific part of their bodies. However, titties. Nice. Um, booty. Nice. It's actually kind of hot. <laughs> Is this supposed to be the same person in different shapes? Like she started out poor and then became an aristocrat and then went goth, uh, got naked and went to hell. <laughs> I don't know. I have no context for anything here yet. Style your home. Master Chef Don McCormick's interview. Food waste and what to do. Sri Lankan kitchen. All right. No, hold on. November one home related magazine. Oh, number one. Yeah, that doesn't say November at all, does it? <laughs> Yeesh. Uh, Sixteen eighteen. So it's just after four. We don't really need to light that yet, so I won't. Is um, I guess I just have a lighter on my person, so we're not gonna be picking up any dozen matches in this game. It's a shame, really. Everybody loves a good pack of dozen matches. Telephone. It's not the telephone, but it's a telephone. doesn't open. It needs a key. Storage room three. Bedroom. The slowest opening and closing drawers in the history of life. There's anything else important there. Actually, you know what? I'm going to just reopen these. Reopen these so that when I come by again, I can remember that I've opened them. Ooh, doesn't open. Needs a key. All right.
Ah, the burned man. Christ, dude. How you doing, buddy? IV bag is empty. I need to replace it. Okay. Uh. To be honest, it looks more like he has that condition, you know, when your skin loses some melanin and turns like completely white and weird patches. Yeah, it looks like he's got that more than a burn. Is this? Corridor key. Alright, I'll be back with more uh, juice in just a moment. Seems I'm not able to run. Bedroom, storage room, corridor, I guess it's downstairs. Okay, you want me to press it? There, I pressed it. Happy? This is dark. Much better. Third corridor. This is a demo? It seems huge. Danielle doesn't matter. Is this the man himself? Maybe you've got kind of similar hair. This is just got a little closer. It's not a bad looking guy. Not a bad looking guy at all. Those Italians, they're an attractive people. I guess the pictures in this game don't have descriptions like they do in some of the other ones. Oh, miss, you seem to be lacking a face. Kind of cool, actually. I'll be uh, I'll be honest. I'm one of the first people who is gonna um, make fun of AI art, but uh, sometimes it's <laughs> sometimes it's actually kind of cool. Um, some some of the things that can come out of it are are really visually striking and interesting. Um, totally soulless, obviously, but doesn't mean they can't look cool. And I'm sure this is just a screenshot from, like, an old-timey movie or something. Looks like it, anyway. Okay, so we got storage room one and office. And I can't get into either. This needs a combination... Did I get anything in this hallway? No. I'm pretty sure I opened that already. I didn't even notice you. Do you have any gems in your eyes? No? I guess we'll need to turn on the lights to see. Boop. Wait. Oh, that's just the magazine. I know. So I guess the, um, the doors close themselves after some time in this game, which I don't really like. I like to be able to leave doors open so I know I've been through them already. That's just me. Booba. Okay, library. Can I go in the bathroom? This is going to be a smaller room to... Nope. What do we have here? On this flask, there's a month circled in red. November. There's also an engraved phrase. If you're planning to drown your problems in alcohol... Keep in mind that some problems swim very well. Good advice. Um, alcohol is not a solution. It's not a good one, anyway. 1624. Oh, man. That's real time. That's real time right there. 
I thought maybe the first clock was just a coincidence, but... What is this? Raven postcard. Alright, I'll take it. Yoink! Is that, is that the kind of book you can look at? I guess not. Wait, how did I crouch? Can I crouch again? No. Okay. Yeah. I, I Like I said before, right? That it's going to be... This game is going to be filled with this kind of art. <laughs> yeah, it is. You're going to be seeing a lot more of that before it's, before it's done. They even coated the books with it this time. That's different. Usually he, he does uh, actual, like, book covers. But, you know, it's just... Just weird titty girls. Oh well. This is the same computer from the telephone. Picked up Zippo lighter. Infinite light source. Uh, will not decrease fear. Okay. I'll answer the phone when I'm good and ready, okay? Don't rush me, game. I think this, actually, this room feels a lot like a room from the telephone. Just a shape, but the rest of the house is different. Okay, where the hell was the phone? Also, I've forgotten. Playing hot and cold here. There it is. Hello. Who's there? Something's horribly wrong with that wrist. It just, it looks like it's bent at a very impossible angle. Not not even the wrist, the palm. I, I guess maybe. Maybe it could be, but no. It just, I don't think, I don't think so. Something's not right there. Alright, uh, Raven postcard. I uh, haven't got much else here. So where was I? I was exploring this way. I think I looked at everything in the library. I don't even see a fear meter anywhere, so why would I be worried about it? The sweet is never as sweet without the sour. That's a um, fairly basic take on the uh, duality of nature. It's like, there can't be good without evil, so we need to be evil. Well, it's, technically, there can't be light without dark. So what, what is my goal right now? Uh, where's my task list? You really have to... Okay, pay, change the IVs. Organize the postcards. But... How and where? There should be somewhere that I can obviously... Uh, 
start loading in postcards, but it hasn't um, appeared to me yet, or I've forgotten. Oh, look, he's, uh, these, these are not what I'm looking for. These are monitors. They were just glowing pink. Why are they glowing pink? Brother. What is that word for that condition? I, I know it. I, it's just, I'm not able to recall it right now. Um, vitiligo? Or something like that? I've only ever seen it written. I don't think I've ever heard anybody say it, so I'm not sure how to pronounce it, even if I've got the right word there. But it, um, what I'm trying to say, yeah, I'm not making fun of that condition by any means. Um, what I'm trying to say is they could have used like a little more uh, of a different texture on the burned parts of his skin to make it look like a burn. That's all I'm trying to uh, trying to say here. Oh, the candles are regenerating. That's good. So we'll have like 700 of them by the end of the demo. And that means I don't have to be too worried about using them liberally. Hmm. Yep, there's no power. First corridor. Okay, so I got the key here. Third corridor that leads to bathroom and library. This leads to the Daniel book. Lab, I can't open. Looked in there. Oddly enough, this chest isn't interactable. Seems like it should be. I don't know the combination. Apparently I can't open this wardrobe. Why? I'll never know. Office? Oh! Did I miss the office? Did I just not check that door? Blood bag. Sick. Ooh, who do we have here? Bertro. No, oh, Lonely Plane cards again. Uh, except it's apparently a comic book this time. There were collectible Lonely Plane cards in uh, the telephone. I got many of them, but came up short at the end of the game, and it made me sad, because there's no NG+. Plus. So you have to collect them all in one run, and there's just no freaking way, because they also drop randomly. So that's kind of, a, kind of a dumb mechanic. Just hold on, we gotta take a moment to uh, look at the fine art there. Sixteen thirty four. Uh, hanged woman. Mirror postcard. Okay, hold on. Uh, I have a raven postcard. Hanged woman? No, 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 no. Where's my raven postcard? Yeah. No one goes there. From above, everything is more beautiful. Okay, let's look at the two that I collect here. Hanged woman. Yep. 
That's what that is. And she's naked. Because... Daniel can't have a dead woman who's not naked. Oh, well, that's just a head, so... I think this might be I Am Still Beautiful. Oh, moment of reflection. And from above, everything is more beautiful as the Hanged Woman. Okay, so there's three more. What is the purpose of the clocks, I wonder? I... It's weird. Sometimes you can't crouch. I don't know if it's because I'm like too close to an object or what. Does this girl have a sword? Kind of looks like she's carrying a sword, but... Her hand isn't... Eh, maybe it is. I don't know. It almost looks like she's carrying a gunblade. Uh, oh, I got the blood bag. So I can go back upstairs to the patient. That didn't used to be there. But it's just a coat rack, so nothing to be afraid of. I'm actually quite surprised. If this was any other doesn't game, or doesn't matter games game, uh, there would have been like 17 jump scares by now. So, Daniel's at least learned a little bit of self-control. Uh-huh. Okay. Place the blood. What does that do for me? When did I get an attic key? I suppose it doesn't. Mannequin postcard. I'm glad you told me that's a mannequin, because I would not have assumed that much naturally. Great. Gonna have to learn music. Oh, what is this? Bathroom key. Uh huh. Lonely Plain Postal Service. 1987. I wonder if that's the safe combination? Oh, look who's back. It's still just a coat rack, though. It's the boxes from, 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 from Who Knocks. Nice. It doesn't open. There's no way to open it. Okay. Katarina. <laughs> that got me good. Do not speak his name. I feel like Katarina is not his name. Unless that's a man in drag. Now, my question is, what activated the jump scare? Just me looking at the poster? Or you don't think saying the name actually had it? Usually games tell you when they're going to use your mic for stuff like that. So, um, yeah, I'm feeling that that's probably not what happened. 
It could be. Bedroom. Storage room. I've... What the hell? Spider skull? Isn't that like a creature from Dead Space or something? Well, here's the bathroom. So yeah, like what I was saying about uh, yeah, Danielle's learned uh, a little bit of self-control by slowing down the number of jump scares. Uh, Viaggio al centro di Lonely Plain. On this book, there's a number circled in red, 17. A Colombo. I forget what the other number was already, 1987 or something. Not the best year. I guess it's okay. 86 is really where it's at. Kate? Wasn't Kate one of the characters from... <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Wasn't Kate one of the characters from Who Knocks? She never got set on fire, so I don't think that was supposed to be her, but... There, are, there have been other references. So it could be. Uh, where is that safe? It's around here somewhere. Oh ho! Oh ho ho! Okay. Oops, too far. Oops. Shoot, I got the wrong year. What was the year? Where was the year? This oh, this is where the spooky uh, coat hanger ghost was. All right, so what do I? I think I am still beautiful is probably the mannequin. Oops. Uh, this way. Here we go. Wait. What the hell? There's the mannequin. I didn't realize I had another postcard. I guess I got it from the mirror, but then got uh, distracted by the jump scare. A staircase that seems infinite. Oh yeah, look at that. Sooner or later I will arrive. Yeah, that sounds about right. Like, the only one I feel that you couldn't figure out just by trial and error would be Nevermore, because that is uh, a reference to a story that I feel like a lot of people probably have some cursory knowledge of. Um, but generally, that's not something I like in games when they require you to bring in outside knowledge. It just, it seems unfair in a way. Is this broken? Yeah. Okay. Grab some more candles. I don't know why I need the candles. Uh, there hasn't been a fear mechanic yet. And I'll be okay if there never is. Zippo lighter. Where was um that it wasn't here. This is a collectible comic book. What was the thing that had the year circled on it? 
And where was it? Maybe it was in the library? No, because that's where the flask was. But I'll check again. See, this November. I think that was just a random noise. I'm not sure about the other games, but uh, Lost Alone Ultimate definitely had a lot of just random noises that would be thrown in uh, to spook you. Many of them never meant anything. They were just there to throw you off center. Is this the right one? No, that's 17. Okay, so we got 1709. that correct, at least. And I think I searched over this way already, so. Lab, can't open. I wonder if this demo is so elaborate that I'm gonna explore this entire house, or if some doors just aren't going to open. It's a very substantial demo. Like, it doesn't have to be this big. A lot of demos could be over by now. Okay, attic. This seems promising. I remember going up here and finding something. Nineteen eighty-seven. Isn't that what I put? Oh, maybe I had the month and day backwards? I'm thinking of it American style, where you put the day and then the month. Oh. Just because that's the way that our uh, accounts payable system works at work, so that's kind of what I'm used to. I don't we need to find the safe. Even though I am Canadian and should do it European style. Technically. Oh no, it is day month year. So. Can I go in? Is this not right? Wait, well. No, I'm. St I'm just, why did I think November was nine? That's not right. Uh oh. I know better than this. What? What? How? What? How did that even happen? That my brain disconnected the month numbers like that. Yeesh. That was embarrassing. Wish I could edit that out, but. Uh, no, everything here is open. This can't be open. This is a storage room. Why can't I run in this game? Here we go. I don't know why I care, but it did it. I don't think there's going to be a nightstand in the library or the bathroom, but I could be surprised. Who knows with these video games? Oh, electronically locked. Well, let's grab some more candles. For absolutely no reason other than to hoard them. Here is unopened. There's a, you know, a fireplace in this room, so I don't know why I would want to light a candle in there, but 
guess they just give you the option if you feel like it. Yeah, things are pretty dark without that lighter. Please open the key. Well, that's where you think a nightstand would be, the bedroom. I guess it was here. Oh, the last postcard. Oh. Hi. Zombie Lincoln. What? Was the last postcard I got. I didn't look at it. Oh, Bell Tower. Resounds in the memories of the living. Um... Yeah, that sounds like uh, Bell Tower. Mi, re, fa, mi, si, do. Hello? I hear you growling, but I don't see you. Mi, re, fa, mi, si, do. You know, if I can remember that by the time I find the piano again, we'll be golden. Oh! What's a... Deer? I've already forgotten my notes. Mi, re, fa, mi, si, do. Where was the piano? I don't remember. Maybe it's upstairs. Oh, attic. Yeah, that sounds right. Alright. Me. Alright. Bye. Me. See. Yo. Hello. 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 I'm just gonna. Uh, oh. They melted. Skull crab again. Outer life. <laughs> Adarina. So normally when you solve a puzzle in these games, something nearby opens and gives you an item for your troubles. This uh, is issuing that standard. So what do? It's not like a secret. What did this do for me? Was this carpet always here? Hey, buddy. You doing okay in here? Seems like it. Everything is uh, same as usual. You got this horrible blinking red light. Probably driving you insane. Uh oh, I've done all my tasks. So I take it.
He gets very slow when he's not walking downstairs. Zombie Lincoln again. Was that it? Is that it? Oh. No, it just turned out the lights. Uh, oh, thank you. Helpful arrow of blood. Is there another? Uh, I guess this door wasn't open before. Ooh, spookums. We got some candles. Is it spooky or romantic, I wonder? Nobody there. Hey, hey, ha. Oh. You suck? Oh, you weren't supposed to turn around. Well, I, I didn't really have much more option. I'm not going to stand here for the rest of my life looking at this wall. Okay, well, that was Bloody Ink, The Hour of Fear. Um, interesting demo. I guess it's not supposed to spoil anything of the main game story, so I don't know how it's all going to tie together, but, uh... Alright, interesting, interesting. This is, this is, we're off to a good start, I think. That was, that was pretty fun. It's exactly what I expected from a Doesn't Matter Games game. And I'm looking forward to starting the real game. But uh, we're going to call it here for now. That was uh, 45 minutes of demo-ish. Ish? 45-ish. Ish. And I think that's good enough to be its own video. So you'll have to just wait. See what happens next. Just like the rest of us. And uh, that, 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 I guess, is all I need <laughs> to say. Well, I gotta, I'm not great at ad-libbing, and that's what Let's Playing is, so I don't know why I keep doing it. Anyway, thanks you very much for what. Thanks you. Thanks you! What, am I speaking the way I type now? Okay. That's, that's a common typo I make. Thanks you. So, 
Um, <clears throat> thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye!